Now, I'm here. I get into the same position, and uh, someone had a question, what happens if, you know, I do this pass here, and I get in this triangle, and he just stays put, where he doesn't pull in, he doesn't push out. Well, one for MMA, I could just elbow, 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 right? And get a TKO, or just get the bleed, right? But let's say we're grappling and we can't strike, or for whatever reason we can't strike. One thing I can do here is bridge, right? And once I bridge, boom, roll over into the mount, okay? And then for the mount, I could look to reconfigure the triangle or, you know, I could just bail out, get my mount position. And this is something we can do whenever we have a triangle. So even if we just have our standard triangle like this, and maybe he wrapped over the shoulder this way, right? Where it could be hard to finish. I bridge on my head. And look, I roll as I extend my hips out. Boom. Notice I use my hands a little bit to walk over, and now I get top position here. Again, if I wanted to reconfigure the triangle, now from here, I can lock it. And now, I have a much nicer angle. I have the short triangle here. This gives me the arm bar, all sorts of stuff, okay? So, we'll just start this from a normal triangle, right? Like we were doing before. I go for the overhook, boom, I come in here, and maybe I have a shitty triangle, like I do right now. There's no chance of finishing this triangle, but I can still sweep him because he's still stuck. I'll pinch my knees together, he can't pull out, Bridge, boom. All right, now from here, I can adjust. Now I got a nice triangle here. So it doesn't matter if his hand's in or not, you just it the Yes, it doesn't matter if the hand's in. So this could be a normal triangle. They could have the arm wrapped over your shoulder. It could be in the middle. Even if you don't have a triangle, like you, you have that diamond, it'll still work. As long as you have one of his shoulders cut. Because basically that arm that's in the triangle, he lost the post. Right? He's not able to post with that arm. That's what makes this work. So let's say I'm here. Right? Shitty triangle. What's your question? Yeah. Still the same. Yeah. And again, notice how I use my hands there too. If I bridge and he's staying strong, I just push off the mat to get him to fall over. Any other questions? All right, triangle sweep. Let's do it on three. Ready? One, two, three. Boop. Thank you for tuning in. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. That way you'll be alerted when the next video drops. Now, if you want to get more videos like this on a daily basis, go and visit my membership site at ffacoach.com. We have online video curriculums, our daily videos, and you can get bonus courses like the Kimura Trap System for free when you enroll today. So go ahead and help support the channel and visit today.